view from above offers perspective and scale, while observations on the ground define the rules for scientific analysis. A lowland may be wet or dry, a mountain slope slick with rain, or parched beneath a cloudless sky. There are places, urban and wild, where human influence has changed the way water runs off the land. But it's only with data collected from space and the surface that we begin to understand how precipitation works. On the ground, you feel the kiss of morning mist against your cheek. From space, we see how many people are getting wet. One of GPM's strengths is its scalability. Nations that want to contribute in a meaningful way but are not yet ready to step off the planet will play a vital role in gathering worldwide precipitation data. Ground validation stations located around the world will tie the network together, bridging oceans and continents, by focusing the power of an international team on water management issues at local scales. Global measurements, local insights, high-flying hardware, real-world observations lots of data. GPM is more than a group of spacecraft, more than teams of experts. This mission will span the globe. With data coming in from the Americas, Europe, Asia, Australia, and other places around the Earth, a global data processing center will round out the system, make it whole. The pond and the river have become one in the spring rain. Just as individual water drops or ice crystals do not fully describe precipitation, GPM will become more than a collection of parts and people. One drop cannot even water a flower, but many drops can irrigate a field. They can fill oceans. GPM will enhance the accuracy of worldwide weather predictions, new precipitation maps, deeper insight into climate change, more accurate flood assessments, these are just some of the benefits that will emerge as international partners join this global initiative. A mutual need for knowledge becomes a shared quest for understanding. This is GPM. It's about life on Earth.